Our news tonight at 10 Heartland Motorsports Park says it will stop hosting the annual NHRA event after this August. It says a tax bill is to blame for the end of an era. 13's Victoria Cassell looks at now how it all unfolded. NHRA fans and participants are upset after news that the track will be holding its last event in Topeka. This is business, you know, we, we do this for a, a living and uh, uh, it, it's, it's bad. And, and you know, we're losing racetracks everywhere. Um, and uh, a facility like this, there's, it's probably it's one of the nicest ones, it's got lots of parking, it's just lots of things to do here. Um, it's going to be devastating to the sport to lose this. Heartland Motorsports Park announced just hours after the Kansas Court of Appeals ruled that owner Shelby development did not show evidence supporting its claims that it was harmed by what is considered Shawnee County's overvaluation of the racetrack property. Shelby's managing member Chris Payne sued the county in 2019, saying the county's initial $10.4 million valuation was too high, forcing them to pay higher property taxes and lose profit. The county contended Shelby ultimately agreed to a lower $7.5 million value and did not file the process to challenge future assessments. Payne denied an interview, but in a statement, Payne said Shawnee County is succeeding in taxing Heartland out of business with their excessive land valuation and property taxes. He believes the county's actions caused the property to devalue to almost nothing due to taxes. The NHRA also weighed in Friday, announcing they will hold their first ever event at the new Flying H drag strip in the Kansas City area in 2024. But four-time world champion with over 100 NHRA wins in 50-plus years of racing experience, Jeff Taylor says losing the track will have a big impact on the sport. We've raced here a lot. Um, you know, it, it's, it draws a lot of cars. The last time I was here, like I said a few years ago, they had almost 800 cars. It, it's got to be huge for the, I know it's huge for the surrounding businesses, the restaurants, the, the, the motels, and and. Uh, and the grocery stores and everything, it's got to be a big impact for that. And to lose the racetrack, um, I, I think it would be devastating to the city. Heartland Motorsports Park says it will host that final NHRA national event at its track August 11th to the 13th in Topeka. Owner Chris Payne says his announcement only applies to that August 11th NHRA Menards Nationals. He has not closed the property to other events as of yet.